Hey, do you know why a baseball stadium is so cold? Why? Because of all, all the, the fans. fans. <laughs> Every exit of every interstate, one exit a day, and you're coming with. So buckle up and enjoy your ride. Next exit. Exit 218. This is enjoy your ride. Next exit. Meredith and Randy here. I always love these lights. Look at these. They're always timed so perfectly to get your attention always reversing this exit is the exit off the turnpike so we're saying get a take a hike to the turnpike we are finally getting off the turnpike we will be paying our last toll and getting on the true i-80 interstate meredith is there anything you'd like to add well i don't think that this is an exit to get off at this is an exit to get on This is Enjoy Your Ride Next Exit. I'm Randy, that's Meredith. Did you see all those blue signs when we were getting off? This is a, this is a... Happening exit. Thank you, with that ad adjective. You're welcome. Lots of activity, lots of, uh, lots of activity going on at this exit. We're gonna find a whole burlap bag full. yippee ki -yay. Nice rig. Took a look at the uh, fire station. We're making a U-turn here to head back into town. Drops off pretty quick after uh, the uh, casino. That pilot doesn't look so nice. <laughs> it doesn't look very open. never been to a Quaker steak, but I know that there's one in Pigeon Forge Tennessee. that looked really good. The Barrels of Crackers. A staple of America. That is roadside Americana to us, at least to me. Go inside, beat Meredith at some checkers and some, some pegboard. Oh, excuse me. This is my favorite corner of Cracker Barrel. Talking about me. No, you. Oh, you're talking about her. Hey, do you know why a baseball stadium is so cold? Why? Because of all, all the, the fans. fans. Bah. The highest quality call center in the world. Now you can put an emphasis on those three different words and both of them, all three sentences mean different things. The best quality. The best quality. in get it like now do you think meandering around do you think they had any idea what they were doing when they came up with that name i'm sure i am sure yep no doubt 
There's also the, uh, uh, what was it down there? Well, I'll, I can tell you one that I wanted to do was at the Attica Inn. There's a Attica, Indiana had a hotel that closed, and I was like, let's open it back up and call it the Attica Inn, but then spell in with one N. Like Indiana. The Attica Inn, or two N's, but then put the apostrophe after the first N and the period after the second, but I don't know if people would get that. No, they would. Right, there's also the Sleep Inn. The Americ Inn. Like American. Some people. Exit 223, Cracker Barrel, lots of fuel, lots of me beating Meredith at games at Cracker Barrel. I let you win. We were interrupted at the checkers, and then the peg game, we both equally were, were as bad. <laughs> we were both equally just plain dumb. Exactly. So we're hitting the interstate, I-80. That's the first time I've ever seen New York on a road sign. In person, ever. In person, ever. So we're going to be eastbound 80. We'll see you next exit. Until then, Meredith. Enjoy your ride. Next exit. And Randy, enjoy your ride next exit. <laughs>